Well, good day, fishermen. Welcome back to... What are we playing? <laughs> Fishing the North Atlantic. That's right. So, we're out looking for schools for harpooning of swordfish. And boy, oh boy, it is... Unless I'm doing something wrong. They said look for s flocks of seagulls in the little wiki thing. But, uh, boy, oh boy, it's tough finding a school. I have sailed, we'll call it, from... We started it in Yarmouth here, which is way up here. We sailed all the way down to about here somewhere. I found one school. Then I come all the way around, all the way around, all the way around, all the way around. Now we're kind of all the way up here, and still nothing. So... I don't know. Maybe it's because there's no boats up here. I don't know. Maybe it'd be better to go down where the boats are. Um, I don't know. Uh, that's just me sailing. And, uh, boy, I haven't found nothing. So, yeah. Oh, look, there's me up top. Now, how did I do that? Oh, okay. Yeah, press V. So, I don't know what's going on here. Why... I haven't found any more schools of these swordfish. Um, they're, uh, they're caught between August and October. So we're August 6th right now. So there should be lots of good season. I got some on, as you can see. Like, I got some on here. But, uh, we've got room for, uh, 4,300 pounds. We only got 2,300 pounds on right now. So we got lots of room left like to load up the boat so we could go in and uh, you know have a good catch going in but we're still looking for schools so so I'm kind of wondering if I should maybe go back oh no I thought I'd just kind of do big and found nothing so I don't know I haven't discovered that port yet though but um, there's a couple of boats up here I don't know if it's worth going that way or not um well, there seems to be a lot more of them down here, so maybe I'll uh, maybe move back down to that way or something. I don't know if there's something to do. Like, this is obviously the deep water, the trolling area or something here. There's there's boats down there, though, so, I mean, boats all over the place, but it seems like there's no boats where I am here, so maybe that's a sign. Uh, so, we'll need to... Oh, boy, I don't think I'd want to be up top there. But I think if I could get one more harpooning, we could uh, have a pretty good catch to take in. I'll probably take it into one of those locations I haven't been to yet, so we can discover that. But, uh, yeah, they say look for flocks of seagulls. And to be perfectly honest, I haven't found any seagulls at all yet anywhere. There's nothing out here, so... So I don't know. That's very strange. Now the fish finder, if you turn that on, uh, you get a little bit of stuff here and there, but not, you know, not an abundance of stuff. So they don't, I guess, do it quite like the uh, Barrent C one, where you actually have the map that shows you um, hot spots and stuff, right? Like this is just stuff for me to. Yeah, I found snow crab here. But, you know, I don't know. <laughs> uh, I got to try going back where there's more ships down here. Let's just do a... Oh, I'd hate to zip by something, though, you know, and, and miss it. But um, I will sail for a minute here, I guess. I want to just kind of keep an eye on the... Well, there's one swordfish there. What is that guy? He's got lots of fins on him. I got to alert. Oh, the silver hake. That's what that guy would be. Or maybe a haddock. Silver hake, I think. Swordfish right on the top there almost. Oh, 
don't see the school of them here though, but... No. Huh. Well, we'll go back down where these guys are. I'm just going to... Uh, I'm going to maybe just go to here and then we'll sail the rest of the way. Let's just do that. Everybody's moving around. This guy stopped here. Okay. Oh, the boat almost sank. Let's see. What do we got down here? It is very tricky to find a school, I must say. Now what is that that's kind of behind us here? It must be over here somewhere. Oh yeah. Interesting. Yeah, I wanna if I do happen to come across another school, I wanna see if there's seagulls flying around or not. I don't I don't know. Ooh. Wave, I guess. Wow, what a trick. Interesting, there's not much coming on a little bit here and there, but lobsters, or crab, sorry, there's a lobster coming. Lawn spur is what my kids used to call them, lawn spurs. Wow, I didn't think it would be that hard to find a school. We might just have to go back in with what we got. Because, well, it's still got lots of fuel, though, surprising. We could take a venture to the deeper waters and see kind of what's down here. Why don't we, uh, well, we'll go down, uh, let's go, let's sail, let's say we'll sail to maybe here, and then we'll whip down to these deeper waters here. Ooh, that's a long way. I just, I haven't seen anything since that one school. I don't know. It's weird. I mean, maybe it's sort of kind of rare to see a school like that. I don't know. Well, there's lots of stuff here, though. Well, this ought to be a good spot to drop some nets in or something. Look at all of them. Whole bunch of them here. No swordfish. <laughs> Trying to save up, I guess, some money to get the uh, rigging stuff, then we'll probably have more luck. This is, uh, seems to start you with a real hard one. Well, that's okay. I don't mind starting with the hard stuff. If it's, maybe gets easier, I don't know. That is interesting. Just nothing, though. What are you guys catching over there? Anything? A lot of nothing right now. Hmm. Lots of water anyways. Well. Yeah, we'll sail the rest of that, I guess. Kind of like this view better. Get, I think it's wider shot. I can see more. Let's turn this on. Just, oh, yeah, there's lots here. There's lots of swordfish here. There's nothing up on the surface. 
I'm pretty sure I don't have to bait the water. I think you just come across the schools of them and you can do the harpooning. I'm pretty sure anyways. I don't know. Yeah, all that sailing we've done, we've not burnt up that much gas, unless that is a lot. Like if that's like seven or eight hundred dollars or whatever, a thousand dollars to fill that bit, that's a fair bit I would say. But uh, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see when we get back to port here. And this is the upgraded motor too that we put on here, so... Or maybe the swordfish will only come up and uh, come around when it's, uh, you know, like dusk, dusk time. Right now it's uh, 2.37, I think that's what that is. And let me tell you, I've been out here through a night cycle. It is a long time, and it's very dark. And you pretty much can't see anything. <laughs> so, uh, usually just, you could either sail around real fast and go through it quicker, or just shut things down and wait till morning. Which takes probably about 30 minutes of actual real time to get back to daytime, which is a long time, but, I mean, that's part of the game, right? Well, I think I'm just going to go and check the deeper waters now. Maybe, uh, I, I don't know, I don't know something's, something's weird here. Let's just, uh, let's just zip down here and check the deep waters. It might not even let us in here, I don't know. Everybody's leaving for some reason, is that a hint? Okay, let's start here. So we should have... Fairly deep. Yeah, look how much gas we got now. Woo, that ate up a bit. Should have fairly deep waters coming here now. So, uh, oh, there's a ridge there. Hundred and twenty-five meter depth, I think. So there's lots of fish here, though. Of varieties. Um, when we do the rigging, though, I think we can put baits and stuff on. I think that's the long lines or whatever you call that stuff. And uh, I think we can use squid and you'll catch a lot more. I think it's like 85% for um, swordfish. So that would be good. 125. Let's just check our map here again. Yeah, we're, we'll go down. Maybe into this water. I don't know if I'll go this deep out here, but uh, seems to be a lot of boats right there for some reason. They maybe they're catching all the fish over there. I don't know. But uh, I can see this game being really good, but really not super good for um, doing videos on because you're gonna have to cut a lot of things out. You know, I have to to do it. We'll say properly. You'd ha I'd have to s sail around here for a heck of a long time and uh, probably find nothing t <laughs> until we come across something and then start filming that, right? So, uh, I don't know. It's a pretty good game, though. I do kind of like it, but it's uh, one of those ones where it's not good for doing uh, some, you know, without a pile of editing or wasted time, you know, trying to find this. I think once we get into the rigging, though, and the other stuff, the nets and whatever, it would be a lot better. Because this is taking a pile of time here right now, trying to find schools. Uh, like I say, unless I'm doing something wrong. I don't know, maybe I'm doing something wrong. But Look, at the sun's already going down because that little... Yeah, where is the sun? Oh, there he is. Uh, it's starting to go down anyways. 18, 18. It's at 6. 6, 19 p.m. Wow. So, like, yeah, you know what, I should probably go out here a little bit, turn around, and then just make it, make a line back to the, wherever we're going to go back to, and uh, sit there and sail it. Just keep an eye out for schools. It's about the best we can do, I guess. 100 meters. I thought it would have been deeper than that here. There's quite a few fish, though, out here, I must say. Turn that right out. 125 meters. It's fairly deep. 
I kind of wonder if the schools might be kind of closer to shore. Which they probably are. But now if I fast travel back to shore, it's going to be pretty much like midnight or whatever. It'll be really dark. So I'd have to shut her down until the daytime come again. But uh, well, I'm just going to go out here a little more, I guess. Let's keep looking around to see if you can see any schools. But I, I kind of wonder if they're just going to be closer to shore. They like, uh, I was reading there too, they like the tropical kind of water stuff. Oh, I think my boat just jumped out of the water. <laughs> oh, there's lots of lobsters here. Yeah, lobsters, you probably go a lot deeper. But if you go into the map and then into the wiki here... Uh, fish, whoop, general, fish types, sword fish, yeah, August to October, every season, large and highly migratory predator fish characterized by long, flat, pointed bill, they're popular sport fish, uh, blah, 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 fish, long, I don't really want to know what they look like, um, from widely found widely in tropical and temperate parts of Atlantic, Pacific, and Indian oceans, they found a near the they can be found from near the surface to a depth of 550 meters. Holy cow! Come on the reach, uh, blah 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 blah. But it doesn't really tell you in the game where to find these schools, so that is the trouble. But yeah, fish bait here though. This was interesting. So if you use squid, uh, swordfish is 85 percent. That's pretty good. So, but anyways, we'll uh, I guess we'll continue out to here, and then I'll maybe fast travel back, or I'll just pause the video and and then slowly head her back to. Um, uh, we might go back to this port, or maybe this port here. I don't know. They're probably both about the same. But uh, see, I'm getting to somewhere again where there's no boats. <laughs> so, what does that tell you? I don't know. Let's go to where it's the deeper here and see what we see down there. Uh, back to 100 meters. Oh, I can't believe I've only seen that one, that one school. I did pretty good. I got them all. 2,200 pounds of swordfish there, but. Nothing since. Maybe that's why they pay you so good to um, start here, so you can actually get into the rigging pretty quick. I would kind of imagine. Well, we'll just cruise on through here, I guess. I kind of thought the water might have got a bit deeper, but what are we, we're sort of... Uh, we're darker blue than that, so something's not right here. This is more like... This is more like 1,000 meter depth here. Hundred twenty-five meter. I don't know. It, that doesn't seem right. I think their fish fender's all meshed up. Because if you look, if you look here, it's darker blue again. Now we're, I think, we're into the 3,000 meters, and then that's 4,000 meters there. Super deep, right? Then of course, four meter is like almost gray, which is like right up in here or something. We're up in here, so this would be the four meter here. Real shallow stuff. Four meter. You probably see the bottom there. So that's interesting. We are quite a piece out here. I'm going to say around a thousand meters, so I don't know what's going on with, with the fish finder here. but There's quite a bit of fish out here, though, isn't there? Well, I don't honestly think we're going to find schools of them out here. So let's set course for for back to the 
port. I might go this one though because I sort of, well, sort of kind of already been down through there, but. Let's do that, I guess, and uh, we'll head her back home. Whoa, she's going to tip over. <laughs> and I'm going to pause the video, and uh, I'm going to sail this back. I don't really want to put you through sitting through that. Cause that's probably going to be, uh, well, how far do we got? 24 kilometers. Yeah, that's going to be probably a while, so. Uh, boy, oh, boy. That's crazy. But anyways, if we come across the school, I'll, you know, if not, well, well, then we'll hit her back into port with what we got, I guess. So we'll see you in a second. Well, not a thing yet. And uh, the sun's pretty well gone down. We've got a nice sunset shining here. Or not shining, I guess setting now. <laughs> and uh, not, a, not a nothing. So I think maybe what I'm going to do is go back to port. We'll go discover this other port. I'm going to go back to port and... Um, if you remember, you go into the bar and you get tips where you've seen fish last kind of thing. I'm going to try one of them, but um, I'm just going to keep sailing here. Let, this, let the uh, the night go through. It gets really dark. <laughs> like, really dark. So, probably should turn on this work lights, maybe, and the searchlight. And, uh, yeah, it gets really, really dark here. So, anyway, so as you can see over there, it's really, 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 really dark. You can't see anything. But since as we're kind of on mission to get back to port, I will just kind of keep going here. But uh, last time it went nighttime, I just stopped and let it go through and then continued on after. So, But uh, anyways, we'll see what we can find if we get anything on the way back here. I'm highly doubting it, but we're going to go try to check out the bar or whatever there for the tips. Well, I must say it is really nice here at night. Um, lots of stars. Go to the view there. You can look up and see. See all the stars out there. Yeah. But uh, still nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. So I don't know where all the fish are. I think they've all gone home. But uh, anyways. We'll get into port here. Uh, let's just double check the map. I think I'm going a little bit. Yeah, let's go. This way we'll discover this port here, I guess. We'll take our fish in there and see if we can get a, a tip or something where there may be some more fish where somebody you know else saw some or something or whatever. Try to get one that's more recent rather than the seven day old one because that was uh, not so good. wind generators up over there. That's kind of neat. So, yeah, I gotta just keep basically going straight here. No fish at all. <laughs> Only jumping. That makes it kind of tricky, but we'll try this tip. I bet you the tip will get us some. I got a fair few there, and I just come across them, which I figured, I, you know, I would have just come across another school of them somewhere, but holy cow, we went a long way. We are probably almost down to half a tank of fuel now. And it's just turned over midnight right now, so... Still pretty dark, but it actually lightened up a whole lot more, which is kind of weird. But anyways, yeah. 1.2 kilometers... going to spend probably a pile of money and fuel here to refill the boat and then uh, oh we'll go check the bar out I guess and see if we can get a tip and then uh, I'd like to get into the long lining stuff that'd be maybe a little bit better but anyways I don't know what this port's going to be 
I guess we'll find out when we get into her there. I think that's it right there. I think it's in there somewhere. I believe so, anyways. All right, well, I guess we'll get down off of here. back into here. Now, I don't know. Let's check our depth here. Yeah, we're 50 meters here. So. Which is... Is that actually 50 meters, or are we... I don't know. I think that's 100 meters, but anyways. I, I don't know. Lighthouse there, I think. So yeah, we'll, we'll whip into port, get rid of the fish here, sell them off. See if we can find a tip and then I'll fast travel it to where the tip was, see if there's anything out there. I guess that's about the best we can do. Um, now let's just double check this. So yeah, so we're just up here on the left, probably where that lighthouse is. No, the lighthouse is out there, sorry. It's up in here somewhere. I don't know what port that's going to be, though. That'll be interesting when we get here to see. Oh yes, I can see the bluey blue there, I guess. Should be able to discover that fairly soon here, I would think. Now let's just dip it in here and get rid of this. There we go. Yeah, little lighthouse there. All right, what do we got here? Thing keeps opening up. Watch you go to the you go to the map. No, and that thing's open again. Dennis Point discovered. I didn't even know that existed, honestly. <laughs> Dennis Point. I'm going to have to look that up on the maps now. That's interesting. Should give us our docking symbol here. Hopefully. There we go. Fish on board. Would you like to sell your fish at Dennis Point? Sure. Estimated revenue, revenue 25,000. Yeah, I'll do that, I guess. Alright. Now, dock. 
Let's get some fuel. Six hundred dollars worth of fuel. That's not bad. I thought it would have been a lot more than that. Repair the hull. Thirty-seven cents. <laughs> Change name, I don't want to do that. Uh, okay, so let's go to the town. To the bar. Tips. Location from a week ago. I don't want that. Oh man. Missions. Help deliver a cargo to another port. Eh. I bet you couldn't fast travel doing that because it'd be an easy way to make some pretty quick money. Well, that didn't kind of go over too well, but, uh, oop, no, I don't want that. I want, uh, what do I want here? Dock. Rigging. Fish, well, we could do the, the deep line fishing now. Let's buy that. Okay, so we equip that. That's good. And what else are we going to need? Um, uh, oh, skip time. You can skip time there. Oh, okay. But you can't do that when you're out on the water. Fish market. Fishing gear. Buy deep lines. I think I've already got that, but I gotta buy bait. Bait deep ones, that's what I'm after. Uh, oh, yeah, okay, we have a bunch of deep ones. Okay, so. Squid or herring, I guess, is all we can get for that. Well, let's do one. Herring. Two herring. Did I do that right? I think so. Okay, squid, squid, herring, herring. Okay. So, we should. We should be good now. Oh. Deep line fishing requires a crew to haul line. Are you sure you want to leave a port? No. Okay, so we got to go to town. Crew. For hire. Rudy! Rudy came back! I don't think that's the same guy. <laughs> Higher cost. Wow, are they expensive? I don't think I got that much. Um, okay. Uh, uh, Higher cost. So I seriously have to have that much money. Not enough money. Woo, I'm going to have to go to the bank, I guess, then. I guess, I guess, I guess. Bank borrow. Let's take a twenty twenty thousand dollar loan. Wish it was that easy. <laughs> Crew. Wait a minute. What did that say? Crew. Crew house. I don't have anybody in the crew house. On board. Nobody on board. For hire. So we need the long line haul. He sucks at that. Well, he's pretty good, but he's expensive. I don't have that much money. Long line haul is not too bad, I guess. 31,000. Wow, these guys are expensive. 20,000. I'm just going to have to get uh, one of the lower guys, I guess. So, um, how about Josh? He's pretty good. Okay. So Josh is on board. Now we can go. Alright, so we'll go out somewhere here and set our lines. And uh, we're going to have to let them sit and soak for a while too. Uh, Head her out here. I think I'm just going to fast travel because uh, it takes so long to get out there. Uh, so, set 
this here, here. Maybe we'll go here somewhere. Okay, let's hyperdrive. Woo! I see a lot of people out here. Oh, it's dark now. Holy cow. 4 a.m. That's going to be getting bright soon, though. Um, okay. Whoa, it looks like this is dropping off pretty rapidly here. Let's just sail for... Why is it... Why is it so... No, I guess it's fairly deep there. Well, let's uh, just keep an eye on the... Fish finder for a sec here. So we got herring and squid on. Herring and squid is good for uh, herring and squid fish bait. So herring is good for lobster, really. And I, not for this though. Uh, snow crab, swordfish, mm, tuna. Well, that's all right. And squid, swordfish, hopefully. All right. Well, let's keep an eye on the. Oh, there's a bit here, I guess. Let's set one here. Can't set a deep plane before it has been been prepared. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, stop there for a minute. What do we got to do to prepare the line then? Gear on boat. Um, okay. Oh, prepare gear. We got to get him to do that. You get in there and we prepare that gear there, bud. Okay, that one's ready. I wish I could see what we were doing, but anyways. We'll set this one here. Uh, boy, I wish it was brighter out. I guess it's still setting. I'm not actually too sure. Yeah, it must it must be. Oh, those must just go straight down. I'm used to the long lines, I guess. The Are oh, these are long lines? I don't know. Deep line, deep line. Okay, so deep lines and long lines. Okay, I got her mixed up. That makes sense now. So these just kind of plunk down and they go way, way deep, I guess. That's... Well, there's a few fish here. Set them in, I guess. For squid... I think that's all the lines we got. Yeah, we don't have any more. So, we'll shut her down here, I guess. Pull the motor up. And uh, we'll have to wait. I'll put uh, him back into rest. All right, you go have a rest there, bud. Where are you going? You're going to just disappear. Pew. All right, so I guess we got to wait again until those turn blue. Red, yellow, green, and then blue is optimal, apparently. So, more waiting. <laughs> so, we'll see in a few when those are ready to go. I gotta should have got myself back around to one, I guess. I guess we still could. 
take ourselves back to one. Hopefully by then the uh, the sun is up and uh, we can see what we're doing. Well, they're there somewhere in the water, but I don't know where. So I wonder now if I come across a school out here, if I can still go and harpoon them. Ah, uh, never thought of that. Yeah, so we have no more harpoons. All right, well, we'll head her back to the first one. And we'll have to wait, so we'll catch his all, and hopefully we got some fish on. All right, just doing a bit of reading here on this deep lining stuff. It doesn't really work like the other ones, I guess, with the, the colors, although they have changed from basically red when we started to blue. But there's something I guess I didn't know. Um, uh, what was it? Deep lines are equipped with a a bite sensor and pulled as soon pulled up as soon as the fish gets hooked to increase the quality of the catch so we got to go back here and check these lines it's getting dark again of course so I just saw that deep line bite thing there so we'll go back to one I guess some kind of sensor or something but hey look at that it's already getting dark again <laughs> I've been waiting and waiting and waiting and actually use the, uh, uh, what do you call that, quick thing to do, uh, move myself around and kind of kill the time a bit faster. It's taking forever, so. <sighs> like, again, it's, like I say, it's like the other game. It's a really good game, but uh, it's, uh, it takes a lot of time to make a, a video out of it, so let's put him over here. Now I gotta go to this side, I guess. I don't know what's tripped and what's not, though. I guess this means that it's tripped when the thing's falling off, because I think this yellow one was up higher. So I. Oh, yeah, there they are. Ooh, we're gonna have to get used to this. Got him! Oh, he's a big feller. What is it? It's a whale. I don't know what that was. Looks like a blue fin tuna. Holy night, that was pretty good. Let's look at the details. What is it? Does it tell us what we got? Uh, no, it doesn't tell us in here. Log book. Deep line bite. Oh yeah, so there you go. Deep line bite. Okay. Catch a few seconds ago. Oh yeah, it was tuna. Two tunas. There you go. So there we go. We got some tunas. Well, there's that's pretty cool. So that is kind of different. That's that's actually kind of cool. So you technically probably don't have to wait so long as long as I did, but uh, anyways, that's all right. Turn that on so we can hopefully see where the second one is here. So you could probably plunk all these down fairly close to each other, I think, if you really wanted to. Well, let's see what we get in number two here. Yeah, it looks like it's trip two. Now, I would have known that, I guess, if I had seen what I was doing when I was throwing them in, but it's getting dark again here, so... But we'll probably head her in after this, I guess, and, uh... See what we get for money here. Well, what does that mean? I don't know what that means. All right, here comes some fish. Missed. Well, it doesn't make it very easy when the guy moves. Oh, what's that one? Another tuna. Ooh, that's a big feller. Looks like a big feller. 
What is that? That's I think that's another tuna. We're getting all tunas here. I don't know why I keep missing. Hey, I got him that time. Perfect. Looks like a big whale. <laughs> I guess that's a tuna. I don't know. All right, so. I don't want to set a line. No, oh, that's not opening up again for me. Let's go over here. Go back. There we go. No, oh, not too bad. We still got uh, oh, quite a bit of... Ooh, we're going to go past this one. Quite a bit of room left. We're about half full, I guess. Ooh, that doesn't look like a tuna. That looks like a dolphin. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing wrong here, but this seems odd. Whoa, that is a swordfish. Holy cow, look at the size of that mother! <laughs> Holy cow! Oh, another swordfish. Oh, this would be the swordfish bait. This would be the squid here. Okay, I don't know how... What is it I'm doing wrong here? This keeps missing. Left mouse button, use hook. I think that guy sucks just about as... Oh, he's got one. Say, I think he sucks just about as much as I do. I don't know what the heck I'm doing wrong here, but I'm not catching them. Well, that's interesting, isn't it? Oh, I don't get this. I don't. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing wrong here. There we go. Maybe you got to just got to wait longer. I think we lost one though. He's still fighting one. Oh no. Yeah, I think we we lost. We lost one there. Well, we'll get the last one here anyway. See how we make out. Then we'll head her into port. Maybe we'll go to the other port. We can discover that one today, too. Oop, went past. Back her up there, bud. There we go. Let's try this again here. I got that guy. Another big swordfish. It just seemed to disappear. Maybe I gotta wait till the. Oh, uh, no. I was gonna say, maybe I gotta wait till the. I thought maybe wait until that circle gets bigger. He's missing too, though, so it's not just me. Hook. Oh, 
I got him that time. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what the deal is with that. Another thousand pounds. So what's our total here? Um, Fifty-one hundred pounds. Well, that's not bad. Now we haven't been to this port, so let's make trails to this one. Fast traveling. So that wasn't too bad. That hooking stuff's weird though. I must not be doing something right. I don't think it really says in here about this uh, fishing types. That was um, deep. No, fishing. Fishing types. Fish types. Oh, sorry. Fishing tools. Um, deep line. I don't think it really says anything about the hooking. No, that doesn't give me much help on that. You might equipped with a bite sensor and blah, blah, blah. Yeah, okay. Well, we know that. I don't know. Um, okay. So, undiscovered location. So, we got to go left here. So dark, I'm going to use uh, one of these things. Oh, yeah, I guess he could go back to rest now. All right, whoop. Probably actually, you know what? Should save. 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 Yes. Okay. Well, we got a bit more fish stacked up this time. That's good. Some big fellers, some tunas. Oh, tuna. Blech. I can't eat fish like that. Oh, no way. Just no thank you. <laughs> Let's check the fish finder. Any fish here? Oh, there is too. Wow. Didn't have to go it so far, maybe then. We don't have any baited lines, so... Whoop. So we are done for fishing. So we'll go in here and discover this port. Um, now, is there one more port? Or is that... Yeah, there's one up here we got to do. So maybe next time we go fishing, we'll... We'll uh, go up this way. All right, see how much cash we can make off of here. We got a bit of a bank loan we got to pay off too, right? $20,000. So that'll be pretty much all we made here. But uh, we're darn near full. We got a little bit of room left, but I uh, could have probably done one more line, but that's all right. That's pretty good. Actually, you know what? If I didn't lose that one, I think we lost one. I'm sure we lost a fish there. He lost the uh, targets on his on him there, and I think we ended up losing them, but uh, who knows. All right, so we got to go in here. I don't really see where I gotta go yet, but there's a little bit of a something there. I think I gotta go around right up here. I believe so. Go this way a little bit. Might be a water water break thing or something, I don't know. New port to discover anyway, so that's good. Yeah, I think we gotta go in here. That's this little, that's this little water break thing right there. That's right there. So that's good. Just get in here and get this sold. We didn't burn up that much fuel this time, so that's good. There we go over there. I don't know why it's red though. Lockport. Hmm. Well, there we go.
Yay, final waypoint. Okay, let's throttle down a bit there. We'll get docked here. Fish on board! Would you like to sell your 52,000? Woo, that's not too bad. Tuna's pretty good. Swordfish, not the greatest. But uh, we had five of them tunas for swordfish, so that's pretty good. So we got some money. Let's uh, go to the bank and we'll repay that loan we took off. There, gone. All right, I like that. Now let's just see here. In town, ooh, in town again. Bar. And any good tips? A week ago, three days ago, Pollock, Silver Hake. A week ago. Mm. I don't want to take those ones. But anyways, uh. No, I don't want to leave. I guess that's where we got to leave that lock part. There we go. But anyways, that is it for North Atlantic fishing today. Thanks again for watching. We didn't do too bad. We, uh, all right, we're getting a little more progress. We got into those deep lines, which is good. I don't think that there's anything else we can do on here. Uh, we could upgrades, of course. Um... Engine is already upgraded. Uh, storage wouldn't be bad. Fishing quota, sonar, searchlight. Now, shipyard, that's what I want to look at. Available. Oh, I guess we're going to have to do a lot more work. <laughs> 695,000. Holy, I don't see the other ones, though. Along here, I don't know if we actually have to go through this one, and then it shows us the next one. We are going to have to do a lot of more fishing, though, which yeah makes sense. Owned, yeah, that's the one we own. We could probably sell it. Can we Don't get much for it? Stable haul it results in smooth ride. Also, rigging for deep line. Yeah, so all we can do is deep line on that. But we made pretty good money there. It won't take us long to get that saved up. But. There's going to be a bit of work, though. But, uh, yeah, anyways, that is it. No, I don't want to leave. That is it for today, so thanks again for watching. We'll catch you all later, and happy fishing!